and today we are going to Napa. Ato Montalena, this is one of the most famous wineries not only in America but in the world. We stand behind our rosé. We do it very traditionally. We grow three different grapes. Syrah, Grenache, and Norvedra. These savory foods, the cheeses and salamis. Hey! <laughs> I don't want, I, don't, I want to be clear. I want to be heard. Yeah. Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to another video. If you are new to my channel, my name is Maddie, and today I have a travel vlog for you guys. I am going to San Francisco with my mom. We are getting picked up in 10 minutes. And I'll go more into like detail about what we're going to be doing there later on today. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this vlog. We just got into our hotel room and what time is it? Uh, two. Yeah, it's 1.54. We are super hungry for lunch because it's... What time 4.30 is it? at home. Or 4, right? Because it's 4.30. It's three hours. So yeah, I, I don't really five. know, but it's we're five. hungry. It's 5 at home. And so we are going to go to the restaurant that's in our hotel. Which um, anyone French fries, right? Yes, please. Okay. Thank you. And a cup and two wines. <laughs> okay, guys. So I already dug in clearly, but I just ordered room service and I got a margarita pizza, some French fries, of course, a glass of red wine, and a water on the side. The city is absolutely beautiful. I'm so excited for tomorrow. I'm gonna go ahead and eat this. My mom's at a work event right now, but I'm just chilling here and watching the Kardashians in all honesty. everyone I just finished getting ready I would have showed you guys like the process of me getting ready but the lighting in here is absolutely just not good and the mirrors are in spots that are like dark so I'll definitely film me getting ready tomorrow for Napa but I just realized that I didn't explain to you guys like what we're doing here so basically my mom is here for work and she was like why don't you just come we've never been to San Francisco before so that's why I'm here with her. Um, and today we are going to Napa. I'm so excited. And we're leaving this hotel right now. And we're going to a hotel near Napa um, because we're going to Napa today and tomorrow. But fun fact, Biden and the first lady are actually staying in our hotel right now. And so there's, I don't know if you can see, but there's like secret service and cops like surrounding the hotel. And we're not allowed to leave until he leaves, so. It's awesome. <laughs> but we're super excited for today. I have always dreamed of going to Napa, so it's gonna be a good day. But I hope you guys enjoy this little vlog. We're on our way to Napa. With on Matika. our way to Napa. <laughs> this is Jay Sana and this is my mom. You guys know my mom. Hi. <laughs> you guys excited? Did We're you super Tika? excited. Yeah. Oh. And they saw Natika yesterday at lunch. Did you see me? Oh my God, look back there. I'm so excited <laughs> to be a part of the vlog life right now. Perfect. Oh. Yeah, just come back. Oh, 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 oh,
<laughs> okay. <laughs> Be outside. <laughs> 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 Thank you. vineyard and I'm gonna have our friend here Tosh tell you guys about a wine okay Hello, everyone. take it away <laughs> Hello, everyone. my name is Tosh Bundy it's nice to meet you so you are at Chateau Montalena this is one of the most famous wineries not only in America but in the world in 1976 it won its covered prize called the judgment of Paris and this was a Chardonnay that won on a Saturday and another Napa wine won on Sunday for Cabernet called Stagsley. Um, it's a stunning wine. 2020 was a very difficult year here. Very good wine. We had terrible fires, but this is a beautiful wine. When you think about it, you think about um, grape, grapes, obviously beautiful white grapes, about fresh peaches, getting pear, oranges, and a nice like kind of cream brulee. Just a lovely presentation of the wine, so thank you. wineries treat rosé as an afterthought. They use some existing juice and they press it off to make a rosé, or they actually will put a little bit of red wine into a white wine. We stand behind our rosé. We do it very traditionally. We grow three different grapes, Syrah, Grenache, and Morvedre, mm. which are the three southern Rhone varietals, and southern France is where rosé is came king. There. So, we pick these grapes separately, ferment them separately, and then blend them together before bottling. So we really stand behind this rosé. On this rosé, which is bone dry, 0% residual sugar, you're going to get lovely cherry lifesaver fruit notes on the nose. And with these savory foods, the cheeses and the salamis, that crisp rosé is going to go beautiful. Mm. Spanish style home. <laughs> okay, we just finished up at the second vineyard and now we are going to, what's it called? Picanha. <laughs> Picanha. Picanha. And what is it? A wine tasting? A wine tasting. Wine so beer. we're going to a wine tasting right now and then we have dinner reservations at 7.30. It is currently 5.45. But we're excited. The vineyard was absolutely beautiful. Both of them were. Um, Natika got a wine membership at the Hello. second place. <laughs> and then my mom got two bottles at the first place because they were like absolutely amazing. Steven, Karen, thank you so much for telling us about this place. <laughs> right, right, right. Yeah, sure. It's almost embarrassing. <laughs> I, was a little, I feel like I was on the outside looking in. She said, we're just chilling. He's like, okay. Okay. <laughs> She cause she is over here giving me all the grief. Oh my gosh, not the grief, my darling. Let me just chug my drink. I'm just saying, okay. Do you want us to cancel the winery? No, that's not oh, what okay. I'm saying. So you chug that. Look at this one. Look Love at that. Did y'all see this? Chug, chug, chug. Oh, 
guys still pursue it? Am I able to get a glass of that or no? Is that a thing or maybe not? It was like, we'll see. And walked away. What are you doing? Wait, is this a good angle, my darling? Is that good lighting? Like, let me take off the blue. Oh, Who does yeah. it? <laughs> yeah, but it's just not. It's not. Me. Oh, with his two chains like too. Black? Huh? You like mostly mm. black? Dark green. Green. Mm. He's emerald. I can see that. Royalty. <laughs> 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 Let's go. Okay. All right. He's real ready. Hold on. Let's, let's move. Are y'all good? <laughs> no, I, I, I'll wait. I'll wait. It's okay. Because <laughs> I don't want. I don't. I want to be clear. I want to be heard. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. you know? And you should be. <laughs> I'll step up my voice. It's not usually how I talk. Right here is the Attila Zinfandel. These grapes come from the Sonoma County AVA. These grapes come from 100 plus year old vines. Smaller vines, smaller grapes, more sugars, meaning more alcohol content. This is a 15.0 alcohol. These grapes produce more of a fruit forward note to it. A little bit more of a strawberry cherry. A nice sensual flavor. It also has a little bit of spice, like green pepper or black pepper. Perfect for barbecues, spicy foods, Indian foods, Korean barbecue, along those lines. Mm. This also has a nice elegant finish and a little bit seductive. Ooh. Mm. I like mm. it. it is <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Hello. 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 Welcome to Brainy Vista Thank you. Hello. Beautiful. Thank you. Thank you. Every one of these you like the most? Just let me know. We talked about Frank Bartholomew purchasing this property in 1943, right? He purchased it as a present for his wife Antonia, who is Antonia's garden. And F Antonia wanted absolutely nothing to do with the property in the slightest, hated every ounce of it. Like I said, Frank was not a super wealthy man when he first bought this property. So right down there, there's a little villa. It's our museum right behind those redwoods. And there's a letter in it because Frank went off to World War II a couple years later, right? Left Antonia with the property. She, she writes him a letter. It reads, come home, you coward, and help me take care of this property that you just purchased for <laughs> all of that us. That part. That so, part. That part. We got right. that part. So that's one of those, you know, I got to make it back alive or she'll kill me sort of moments going on right there. And of course, Frank makes it back. The only work Antonia did on the property at the time was her little garden right over there with some of the original trees planted out behind it. Wow. It is about two days later. I just finished editing this vlog for you guys, but I wanted to go ahead and end it off here. Because I'm filming another travel vlog, we are currently about to leave for Hilton Head for my best friend's brother's wedding, and I'm so excited to film it for you guys. But I hope you enjoyed this video and enjoyed all of the Napa content. It was honestly incredible. I will definitely be going back. Comment down below which vineyard or winery was your favorite. My favorite was Tampa Bay with the horses. It was absolutely beautiful. And we got a charcuterie there and it was so good. But anyways, I will see you guys in my next video and I love you.